<laughs> Congratulations, Frank and Frank. You boys are having quite a day. We won everything. Yeah, we won every event. Thank you. Thanks. I'm thirsty. Yeah, I am thirsty too. Hey, let's race to the water fountain. <laughs> Good race, Claude and Doris. Timothy, Fritz, Lily, and Grace, well done. That was a long race. I'm tired. Come on, Yoko. Come on. All right. Great race, Yoko and Nora. Hey, where's Charles? Oh, here he comes. Go, Charles. Go, Go Charles. Charles. Run. Come on. Excellent running, Charles. Thanks. Charles finished last again. He must feel bad. Uh-huh. He must feel really bad. Maybe Charles needs a coach. Maybe Charles needs two coaches. We can show him how to run faster. And jump higher. And we can show him how to play soccer and football. Then he can do better next sports day, and he will not feel so bad. And then we had a race around the schoolyard. We won that, too. It sounds like you boys had a great sports day. We did, but I don't think Charles had a good day. Oh? What happened? He finished last in everything. Oh, that's a shame. We are going to coach him, Dad. Yeah, so he can do better next time. Maybe then he won't feel so bad. That's a great idea. I'm really proud of you boys, wanting to help out your friend. Thanks, Dad. Thanks, Dad. Dad. Dribble the soccer ball around the cones. We'll make sure you don't miss any. Try to do it as fast as you can. OK. Oops. Don't worry, we'll show you how. Ready, Frank? Ready, Frank. Go! Go! Hmm. I like this shape. This will work. Me first! No, me before you! Me first! Okay, we'll both go first. I'm finished. I'm finished too. Your turn, Charles. I do not see Charles. I don't see him either. Maybe he feels bad because he couldn't dribble the soccer ball. Let's try something else. <laughs> How about jumping? Okay. <laughs> Yee-haw! Yay! Whoa! Hmm. This is perfect. There he is, 
Frank. We can show you how to jump really far. Okay. First, run up to this stick. Then, jump as far as you can. And we'll measure how far you jump. Okay. <laughs> Good jump, Charles. You jumped this far. Now watch me. I'll show you how to jump really far. We are ready, Frank. Hmm, we need a longer piece of string, Frank. Let's go find Henry. He has lots of string. We will be right back, Charles. Okay. I can use this too. Now, we are going to show you how to jump higher. Yes, you will be able to jump very high. Okay. I will mark how high you jump with this chalk. Then you can try to jump even higher next time. Ready? Ready. <coughs> this time, bend more, like this. And stretch up as high as you can, like this. Okay. <coughs> now, I will show you how to jump higher. And uh. I will show you how to jump even higher than Frank. I can jump higher than Frank can. Uh. And I can jump even higher than you. Hey, uh. this is just what I need. I can jump higher. Uh. See? I jumped higher than you. No, I jumped higher than you. Let's ask Charles. Charles? Where did he go? I don't think this is working, Frank. I do not think so either. So, how are my two coaches, hmm? Not very good. Oh? What's wrong? We tried to show Charles how to dribble a soccer ball. Then we tried to show him how to jump higher. And then how to jump farther. But nothing is working, Dad. Charles isn't getting any better. Yeah. He must feel really bad now. Well, maybe helping your friend is going to take more time than you thought. Maybe you're right, Dad. We'll keep trying. That's my boys. We are going to show you how to throw. Really far, like this. Wow. And like this. Your turn, Charles. Try to throw it as far as you can. OK. <laughs> Whoa. Hmm. Maybe we'll have to show you again. Yes, we will show you again, Charles. I have to get my ball. I have to get mine, too. This will be great. Charles is gone again. Maybe we should try the tires this time, Frank. Okay. It is your turn now, Charles. Don't forget to step in every tire. Yes, and make sure you do not drop the ball. We will time you to see how fast you are. Okay. Ready, set, go! The hand isn't moving, Frank. Huh? It is not ticking either. Maybe it's broken. What's broken? The stopwatch. It is not ticking. Did you wind it up? Oh. oh. No, we did not wind it up. <laughs> It is working. Thank you, Timothy. 
What are you guys using the stopwatch for? We are timing Charles to see how fast he can run through the tires. Well, Charles isn't running through the tires. Huh? He, he isn't? isn't? I saw him rolling one of the tires away. You, you did? did? We have to find him. See you later, guys. That's better. There you are! We could not find you! Don't feel bad, Charles. What? You will get better. Yeah, we will keep coaching you so you will run faster and jump higher and throw farther. So do not feel so bad. I'm not feeling bad. I'm having fun. You are? Then why did you stop running through the tires? And why did you stop trying to jump farther? And higher! Everything was fun, but what I really want to do is play with my spaceship. Spaceship? Wow! You made this? Uh-huh. Look at this, Frank. That's the flame from the booster rocket. Look at all the stars. Ooh. What are these? Those rocks are asteroids. Oh. Can we go inside? Okay. But first, we have to put on our space helmets. You look like an astronaut, Frank. You look like an astronaut too, Frank. Wow! Oh. What does this do? It fires a booster rocket. Ah! What is the tire for? That's a black hole. It'll suck us up if we get too close. Oh, that sounds bad. Yeah, that sounds really bad. That looks like your ball, Charles. That's the Earth. It looks small. Uh-huh. Why is it so far away? That's because we're in outer space. Oh. This is a fuel gauge. We almost have a full tank. That's enough to fly back to Earth. How do we get there? First, push that button. Now fire the booster rocket. Hold on. Look, out there, it's a meteoroid. I will get it, Charles. Ouch! Ooh, it is a hot meteoroid. <laughs> do I smell cookies? You sure do. Mmm, I love cookies. No, Dad. They're special treats to take to school tomorrow for Valentine's Day. Can you spare just one, Timothy? Okay, you can have one. What are you making? I'm making a Valentine card. <laughs> You're doing a great job. Thanks. We're making Valentine's at school, but I want to make a surprise card for Yoko because she's my best friend. It looks like a very special card. It needs more decorations. Hmm, I don't think Yoko likes bug stickers. Hey, I know. Can I have some of that icing, Mom? You can lick the bowl when I'm finished. It's not to eat. I have an idea. Oh? Could you put some on this, please? All right. There you go. Thanks. Look, it works. <laughs> <laughs> what a good idea. It's lovely, Timothy. I'm going to put a whole bunch of these on the card. Yoko's going to love her valentine. Hello, Timothy. 
Hi, Henry. Happy Valentine's Day, Timothy. Hi, Doris. <gasps> Are those Valentine cookies? Yes, with red icing. I brought cupcakes. I love Valentine's Day. Are you ready for Valentine's Day, Timothy? Uh-huh. I'm all ready. Are you? Uh-huh. Can I show you something? Sure. What is it? I made a surprise Valentine for someone really special. I put a whole bag of hot red zingers on it. Wow! I made a surprise Valentine, too. Wow! That's a lot of peppermint hearts. Who's it for, Timothy? <laughs> it's for Yoko. Mine's for Lily. She'll never guess who it's from. I didn't know Lily liked hot red zingers. I didn't know Yoko liked peppermint hearts. What if Yoko doesn't like peppermints? She won't like my valentine. Timothy and Charles are looking at us again. Are they telling secrets? I don't know, but I hope they don't know about my secret. What is it? Promise not to tell? I promise. I made a surprise valentine for Timothy. It's an origami valentine with special sour candy on it. I hope Timothy likes the candy. Oh, I wanted to make a surprise valentine for Charles, but I forgot. You can make it when we get to school. I can help you. Good idea, Yoko. Just don't let him see it. I won't. Happy Valentine's Day, Thank you, children. And happy Valentine's Day to you. We're going to have such fun today. Is it time for games? Not yet, but we'll be playing games after lunch, Nora. First, we'll make our valentines. Let's remember to make a valentine for everyone. I'm going to make a valentine for Mrs. Jenkins. Me too! I'm going to make valentines that look like soccer balls. Mine are going to look like footballs. After recess, take the valentine boxes out of your cubbies and put them on your desks. Like this. I'm putting stars and spaceships on my special valentine to Charles. Charles likes spaceships. <laughs> Timothy, they're busy now. Quick, let's put our valentines in their boxes before recess. Okay. What if Yoko doesn't like peppermints? And what if Lily doesn't like hot red zingers? I think Yoko would like hot red zingers. And I think Lily would like peppermints, too. Do you want to trade? Okay. What's the matter, Lily? I don't know if it's special enough. Your valentine has candy on it. Hmm. You can have some of these if you like. Thanks. What are they? Mount Fuji drops. Try one. Wow! They explode in your mouth like a volcano! Charles will love these. Hey, what are you doing? <gasps> Making valentines. That's what we're doing, too. Right, Charles? Right. Do you think they know about our surprise valentines? I don't think so, Lily. Time for recess, boys and girls. We'll hand out valentines after we come in. <laughs> Let's hide our special valentines in their cubbies when they go outside. Okay. <laughs> wow, 
What do we do again, Yoko? I'll make sure Timothy and Charles are playing outside. Then you put my surprise valentine in Timothy's cubby and put your surprise valentine in Charles's cubby. Hi, Yoko. Wanna play tag? Okay. Do you wanna play, Lily? Uh, I have to find my scarf first. I'll meet you outside. She'll meet us outside. Bye, Lily. Bye. <laughs> Timothy's cubby is the one at the end. Or is that Charles's cubby? Oh, no. I, I can't remember which one is which. <sighs> this is Timothy's cubby, and this is Charles's. I hope I got it right. <laughs> Hi, guys! Where's your scarf, Lily? Uh, I, I couldn't find it. I can't wait to give out the valentines. Me either. We know something you don't know. Well, we know something you don't know. Tag, you're it. <laughs> <laughs> now it's time to deliver our valentines. Yeah. yeah. Here's one for you, Timothy. Thanks, Doris. And happy Valentine's Day, Joker. Happy Valentine's Day, Charles. Thank you, Nora. Happy Valentine's Day to you, too. And this one is for Nora. And so is this one. Happy Valentine's Day, Frank. And Frank. Uh, thanks. Thank you, Nora. Look at all the Valentines I have. <laughs> What's this? I think it's a surprise valentine. I have one too. I wonder if it's from Timothy. I wonder if this one is from Charles. Oh, it's so pretty. But it has hot red zingers on it. I can't eat hot red zingers. They burn my tongue. <laughs> Oh, I don't want to hurt Timothy's feelings. I don't want to hurt Charles's feelings either. I can't eat peppermint hearts. Peppermint gives me a tummy ache. What should we do? I don't know, Lily. Paper flowers? Oh, no. Only Yoko knows how to fold paper flowers. She gave me a surprise valentine, and I didn't give her one. Well, what's that, Charles? Yoko gave me a surprise valentine. Hey, look. I got one, too. Huh? The rockets and stars are great, but Yoko knows I don't like Mount Fuji drops. Uh... Thank you for my surprise valentine, Yoko. I like mine, too. Timothy, why did you give your valentine to Charles? I made it especially for you. I didn't give your valentine to Charles. I have your valentine right here. I know it's from you because it has Mount Fuji drops on it. Even if they're not my favorite. I gave them to Lily so she could put them on her surprise valentine for Charles. Lily, I think you mixed up the valentines. Oops, I think so too. Here, Charles. Thank you for my surprise valentine, Timothy. But hot red zingers burn my tongue. Well, actually, I made the valentine with peppermint hearts on it for you, Yoko. Oh, you mean this one? Here, Yoko. I made the one with the hot red zingers on it for you, Lily. Thank you, Charles. I know you like spaceships. Thanks, Lily. I do. And I hope you like Mount Fuji drops. Wow, these are great. They explode in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Quick sticks, children. Time for games. 
Everyone pick a ribbon. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. 